Our top reason men should wear pink this month. And helping guys with their fashion sense. Shaq Shackelford is walking the catwalk around town. Who said Molly Ringwald is the only pretty one in pink? I think men look fabulous in pink. Judy Grove, founder of Turn Tulsa Pink, is calling on men to buy this t-shirt in support of grassroots cancer charities. We're all in this same fight together, men, women, and children. And to me, pink means power, passion, and love. So we're the all-inclusive pink. She's adding an incentive, a contest to win a $250 gift card to Bass Pro. All you need are three things, a camera, a smile, and a real men wear pink shirt. Channel your creativity and the best picture submitted to turn Tulsa Pink wins. I've seen a lot of men that wear pink a lot better than I do. Submissions are accepted through April 1st. Speaking of shirts, what is hip for men as far as undershirts go? So many colors, so many options, I need some help. Guys used to have one choice, a white undershirt. Not anymore. Amanda Viles of Saks says this year, guys need to start putting some thought into their undershirt. Some? What? To think of your undershirt as a layering piece as opposed to a foundation. Esquire magazine dubbed Alternative Apparel's t-shirt the best of 2012. But Amanda says for the most part, it's all about preference. Here's our list of things to remember. Number one. So if you're wearing a classic suit, you just want to make sure you have the white, probably crew neck, uh, undershirt. Number two. If you are doing a more casual look, more casual Friday, more your everyday look, I would challenge yourself to add some color. And most importantly, make sure it fits correctly. Amanda says with casual clothes, V or crew necks are fine. So don't be afraid to show a little personality. See, I'm gonna try to get some legislation passed. I think every shirt should have a pocket on the left. For The List, I'm Shaq Shackelford.